Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls, and this is our daily inspiration card reading. If you would like a personal reading with me, do not wait. Head on over to angelsouls444.com. If you would like to join me on one of my lives, please check that out. I have so many different ones going on. All the information is in the description box below. All right, what do we got here? We have... Bridget. <laughs> okay. Where was it? A couple of days ago, I batch filmed these obviously because I'm not going to, you know, do a five minute video and then take my makeup off. <sighs> no. Th this happens like whenever I film. If you saw me out in the street, I don't wear makeup. <laughs> not, for, not, not much at all. Um, so just a couple of days ago, we had a yes card and then we've got this whoa, 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 hang on. Now, this already, let me read it to you. Caution is warranted. Look deeper into this situation before proceeding further. This is indicating how the ego goes wackadoodle, okay? I got a yes, so I'm just going to, uh, like, go off and do all these stupid things. <laughs> you didn't get all the details, ah. Uh. That's it. That's all I have to say about this. Uh, just be careful how you go charging ahead. When the ego feels like it got its answer, you're like, yep, got the answer. I'm right. That's it. Everybody get out of my way. <laughs> I'm going to charge ahead now. And you're going to realize you're going to get yourself into a lot of trouble. This is where, um, like I, oh shoot, when I first started Angel Souls, um, I would see this all the time. Back when I started uh, becoming a Reiki practitioner was the thing. Now it's like tarot reader. But back then it was being a Reiki practitioner. And all these people would be on their spiritual high. And they're like, I got a message from God that I'm supposed to practice Reiki. And they would go and study. You know, that's a long process to do that. But some of them would take these like sort of compacted, that's kind of how I want to, <laughs> or compressed, these compressed uh, classes and they would get certified, but then they would come out and be, I don't know what was up with that, but maybe because they got the information so quickly, it didn't land or they got overwhelmed um, and they just were not prepared for people with problems to be coming to them. They got overwhelmed, right? So there was this, rush into their practice and I'm in no way shape or form saying that these people were fake or phony or whatever they they did the study but because they went so quickly through the study they weren't allowing their their every facet of themselves of this being to catch up with that process does that make sense so to catch up with what they were doing and so when they would show up some of them were ill prepared to be able to support themselves through that work. And I understand that. This can be very tough. There's so many things, pieces to it. But, you know, it was sad to watch how someone would go from like high, high, high inspiration. All they had to do was just kind of, you know, be steady. I wouldn't even say slow. Just be steady. And give yourself a chance to catch up with yourself. <laughs> right? And instead they went, zoom, and then they come in there and it's just too, they didn't have time to adjust to the difference. Does that make sense? Uh, so that is the kind of thing that this Bridget card is talking about. Pace yourself. All right. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.